Have you ever noticed that when you generate AI characters, the character's look keeps changing every time you generate a new image? What if I told you you can generate images with the same AI characters consistently and that too for free? That's right. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create consistent AI characters, which means you can create any number of images you want, but the characters will be the same. So make sure you watch this video till the end to learn how to do it. This is Brian from Upset Learners and let's get started. To create the AI characters, we are going to use a very famous AI art generator that can create amazing AI images for free. To use this tool, just click the link in the description and it will take you to this website. Here click create an account and sign up using a Google account. Here enter your username, select what your interests are and click next. Click create new image. Here you need to choose the number of images you want to generate. I'm going to select two. And here disable this option because it's only available in the paid version. So it won't work here. Then choose the image dimensions and the aspect ratio you want. And finally, describe how you want the image to be. Make sure you give detailed instructions on the character's age, appearance, preferred background and the action that they should be doing so that you can get to generate exactly what you want. Once you've entered all the details, simply click generate and there you go, we have got the images. Now to download an image, just open the one you like, then click here and it will be downloaded. Now that we've seen how to generate AI characters using Leonardo, let's explore how to create variations of the same character by making slight changes to the prompt. However, make sure you don't make too many changes that would alter your character. Now if you click generate, you can see that we have got a new image with the same face. In the same way, you can create as many images as you want just by making slight changes to the prompt. So these are some of the characters that I created using Leonardo. With this tool, you can get 150 tokens every day and each image generation uses at least 10 tokens. If you need more tokens, you can update to the paid plan by going here and selecting your preferred plan. While Leonardo is a great free tool for generating AI characters, Midjourney can produce even higher quality images, but it's not free to use. So now I'll be using Midjourney to generate AI characters and I'll show you the results. So to generate the images, just click the link in the description and it will take you to midjourney.com. Now quickly sign in and it will take you to the dashboard. To generate the images, just type slash imagine prompt then enter the prompt here and press enter. As I said earlier, midjourney is not free so we need to subscribe to their plan to generate the images. To do that, just click manage account and purchase the plan you want from here. Once you're done, you can start generating the images. If you're using Midjourney for the first time, we have made a detailed video on how to use it. Okay, now when you're entering the prompt, make sure it is easy to understand and fairly detailed. If you don't know how to do this, we recommend that you use this AI tool called Gravity Write which can generate the perfect prompt for your image in just a few clicks. Just click the link in the description and it will take you to this page. Here, specify how you want the image, including the details like the subject's gender, age, outfit and overall look. Once you're done, click create content and you'll see that it has generated different types of prompts for you. Now copy the prompt you want. Once you give the prompt, press enter and as you can see, it has generated 4 unique images and they actually look amazing. Below them, you will see these buttons labeled from 1 to 4 and they correspond to the 4 images generated. Let's say you like the second image, so just click on U2 and it will upscale it and generate a higher quality version of the image. To download it, just right click on the image, click save image as then click here and select all files. 
Now add dot png after the file name and save it to your computer. Okay, let's create more images with the same character. To do that, first we need to copy the URL of this image. So let's copy it. Type slash image prompt. Enter the image prompt you want and then type hyphen CREF which means character reference. Now paste the URL of this image and finally type hyphen CW100 at the end. This value tells the AI to prioritize more on characters present rather than focusing on the background or the environment so that it can give you a similar character's face. So finally press enter and we have got the images with the same character's face. Just like before, you can generate as many images as you want just by tweaking a few details in the prompt. Once you get the image you like, simply click on the corresponding upscale button and download it. Okay, now let's try creating another image and this time you can also specify your character's gender and choose the image style like Pixar or Realistic. I'm opting for Pixar style this time. Now press enter and you can see we've got some amazing Pixar style images. So in this way, you can create consistent AI characters with the same style by making slight changes to the prompt. And these are the few images that I have created. So that's it guys. This is how you can create consistent AI characters. Now if you are interested in creating a professional website for your business, then you can watch this video. Or if you are interested in learning the best tools for your YouTube video, then you can watch this video. If you guys found this video helpful, do give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Website Learners for more cool videos like this one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.